We may have a problem. What's your pro what's the problem, bro? This this jump. Oh! <laughs> oh my god, dude. I don't even think we're gonna make it. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, what's going on everybody? My name is Matrix and I am joined today with my good friend Carboom for a very, very special video. I hope you guys are all excited. Welcome Carboom, how are you today, dude? I am so excited for this video. I mean, it is going to be so, so fun. But what about you? How are you? Dude, I am so hyped. Today, guys, we are starting a very, very exciting series. Me and Carboom have came up with this amazing idea to begin a vehicle simulator series called, uh, well, uh, do we even have a name for it at this point? <laughs> Not yet, I don't think so. Like, like vehicle simulator budget challenge, maybe? I guess something like that. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, that, 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 that is a work in progress, but <laughs> we're starting a very cool series where we're basically going to be giving ourselves a certain amount of money and being expected to buy whatever car we can afford with that money and uh, race each other and see basically who has the better build. What we're going to start with today, guys, is only $25,000. Now, if you didn't know, just the BRZ alone costs $25,000, so... This is a very, very challenging episode, and I think it's a good start. What, what do you think, Carboom? Yeah, I think it's a good base to start from. Exactly, because you can only go up from here. We can only increase the budgets from this point, so it's only going to get better and more exciting with time. But yeah, so we've got $25,000 to spend, including mods, and, uh, and honestly, dude, I'm just excited to go see what we can afford. Now... I want to mention, me and Carboom are both pretty experienced players in this game. Carboom having over 7,000 miles driven. So, <laughs> um, and I obviously play this game quite a bit as well. So we both probably have every single car. I know I do. Um, and with that being said, it is actually going to make us have to re-modify our cars. And uh, so if my car is already modded, which I'm pretty sure my first car here is going to be, uh, let me go ahead and erase all the mods and start from scratch. All right. How does that sound, Carbon? We ready to go, dude? Yes, I think we are. All righty, man. So we're standing in front of the autos car dealership. Uh, what we're going to do, though, is I'm actually going to let Carboom run in first and he's going to go buy whatever car he wants. And then we're going to kind of tag out and then I'm going to go see what I want, because this way it's going to be a surprise for each other. And uh, oh, yeah, that's right, actually, about the whole surprise thing. Um, this is actually going to be where me and Carboom kind of branch off, I think. Do you want to do it at this point? Uh, yeah, we can. Yeah. OK, so we're going to actually branch off. We're going to cut our call um, and then meet back up once both of our cars are modded, because this way we don't know what's being modified. We don't know what car is being modified. And uh, and then that way we can meet back up at a racetrack. Sound good, dude? Yeah, it sounds good. Okay, dude. So you can go ahead and head on in and uh, and I'll see you when we're ready to race, man. Okay, guys. So like Matrix said, I now have to go pick my first car and then I have to mod it at the auto dealership. So I see Matrix going in. So I'm just not going to look and then I'm going to wait for him to come out. So I, so I don't know what car he will be picking because I want it to be a complete surprise. So I'm just going to wait for him to come out and then I'll go straight in. Okay, guys. So Matrix, I believe, has just come out. There he goes. Off to mod his car. Goodbye, Matrix, but now we can go in and pick what car we are getting. So already it's loading up because this is the cheapest dealership that we can get. And seeing as we only have a budget of 25000 we need the cheapest car that we can afford. So here we have the Subaru BRZ, which is 25000 But I don't think that will be much fun because I won't have enough money left to mod it. So I think the cheapest car that we can get is the Chevy Impala, which is only 5000 because I want some money to mod it. And that will leave me with 20000 cash to mod it so let's buy this i think i'm going to get it in red oh but so here we go purchase but already i have the chevy impala so i already own it like matrix said i almost i have almost every car so it isn't it isn't it's expected for me to have this already but yeah i already have modded it like he said but i removed the mods already so yeah it is a stock car right now completely stock so it spawned this in already in the Pearl white, whatever they call it. Oh, I'm sitting in the back. I don't want to sit in the back, but okay. So I'm going to just head over into a secret area because I have the mobile auto shop. So I'm just going to park up here and then I'm going to pull out my perks, press a pocket shop, and let's edit this vehicle. So already, I already know that appearance does not cost anything. So I'm just going to get in a nice bright red. Oh, that's, a, that's actually looks like a nice orange. But no, I want a red, a nice bright red to stand out from the crowd, especially from me. But yeah, secondary, let's go with a deep black. Red and black, they go really, really nice together. Interior looks 
All right, the rims does cost money, but I don't want to spend on that. But I think the rest you have to spend money on. So I'm going to head over to modifications. The main thing about this car is to mod it out that the best I can. But I don't want to spend all my money, let's say, on the engine. So on the engine, I think I'm only going to get... What should I get? I think I should get the level 2. So that is already 5... That is already 4.5 um, cash gone. So I'm going to keep it a tally up here. I'm going to edit one in so you guys know how much money I am spending. So let's purchase this for 4.5 thousand. There we go, guys. 4.5 thousand engine bought. I'm going to go over to Nitros and see what Nitros bottle we can get. But I think we can get the set. The second best, I think that is. Yeah, that is the second best that we can get, I believe, anyway. So let's get that for 10,000. So we have spent 14.5 thousand now. But okay, so that's not too, too good. But yeah, I think this nitros will help us out so, so much. Braking, I don't think we really care about that because braking, when the speed matters, the braking doesn't really matter. So I don't want to spend any money on my brakes. But yeah, that is stock, stock brakes. But guys, I think I'm going to get the racing slicks. And that will leave us with just, I think, 500 cash left. But I can't buy anything with that. So let's buy that. And then we have maxed out. We have used all of our cash. But already, I don't want to spend anything on, let's say, turbo jump or anything like that. Because that is just pointless money for no reason. Like ejector seats, that's not going to improve our speed. Or neither is air control. I think they were the best choices that I could have made. I'm not too, too sure. You guys could put in the comments what you would have done different. If you would have done anything different, definitely leave it in the comments. What would you do if you bought this car and only had 20,000 to mod it? What would you add that I didn't or would change? So, guys, definitely let me know in the comments below. Already, Car Boom. Are you ready? I am more than ready. Okay, dude, I think you're going to be kind of surprised. So, I only had about $1,000 left over after I modded everything. How about you? I only had 500 left over. Oh, oh snap. So you were able to squeeze a little bit more in there. Okay, okay. So, car boom. Um, where are you right now, dude? Um, I'm just over where we started our autos car dealership. Alrighty, man. Well, I'm actually, I'm pretty excited to see what car you went with. Uh, I, I kind of have a feeling I know what you went with, but we're going to see anyways. I'm pulling up now, dude. So what did you pick? What What is that up there, actually? Oh, Oh snap, you got the same car as I did. Nice. Oh, no way. Okay. okay. Nice. Nice, dude. And honestly, I'm glad you went with a different color as well. Yeah. Very awesome. cool, man. Very cool. Okay, so I don't know what just happened, Car Boom, but I spawned my car again, and it's blue. So um, <laughs> I, oh. I literally made it orange. It was literally orange before I came up here, but... Car boom. Anyways, besides the weird glitching paint, um, I'm, I'm excited to see what these cars are going to do. Keep in mind, dude, I didn't really, uh, I already had these rims actually on this car beforehand, um, but I didn't mod the suspension or anything like that. So are you ready to see how these things are going to go, dude? Yes, I am really ready. Okay, man. I'm actually, you know, I'm, I'm kind of curious because you spent, we, we have the same car, but you were able to spend 500 more dollars, which means you probably got different parts than me. Yeah. So this is going to be kind of cool, dude. All right. So what I was thinking, Carboom, was we could start with the airport and basically kind of see how fast these cars are going to go off the lot because that's really the biggest test. What do you think? Yeah, that sounds like an amazing idea. Let's go do that now. All right, man. So let's head on over there. Okay. So Carboom, here we are now at the airport. Um, I'm, I'm really curious to see how this went because I actually didn't get a traditional mod that I think a lot of people get. Um, and I just, it sort of just clicked with me now that I didn't buy it. So, uh, this is going to be kind of cool. This is going to be kind of cool. I'm excited, man. Are you ready? Yes, I'm so excited and I am sure ready. Now, either way, whoever wins this, it, it's just, you know, who's basically faster in a straight line. It doesn't necessarily mean, you know, we're bound to win the race. So let's see. Let's see who's got the faster car, bro. <laughs> These oh. are so slow. Oh, dude. <laughs> oh, I'm dude, taking the are, lead on this. What? You are literally creating like a city-sized bus behind us. Oh, my gosh, dude. Wow. Okay. Uh, okay. Yeah, that wasn't even comparable. Yeah. <laughs> And, oh, uh, wow. and let's see what that gave me. That gave me a 14.7 oh. quarter mile time. That is terrible, dude. That is wow. so bad. <laughs> Holy. Okay. Um, well, you know what? That's actually fine because this car may handle better than you might think. So, so I don't know, man. I'm excited, dude. Mm. So where do you want to take these now? We could try the drifting area. 
Oh, ooh, okay, that would be kind of cool. Alrighty, Carboom, in three, two, one, let's get started, dude. Let's get started. These really extremely slow cars. Okay, there's our first one. <laughs> oh my gosh, dude, this is just a meme, honestly. This is these yeah. are just meme machines. But look at you, you're you're just like way faster than my car, way faster. We may have a problem. What's your pro What's the problem, bro? This this jump. Oh, <laughs> oh my god, dude! I don't even think we're gonna make it. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Oh, and right into the water. There we go. Nice. Um. Oh, dude, we're not even gonna be able to finish this race. I don't. Three, think. two, one. Let's go. Let's try this. Oh <laughs> man. Come on, car. If I can just get it to like one one hundred. Come on. Oh, I'm at one hundred. Hey, let's go. Oh. oh, yes. Oh, you made it. I wasn't even close. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, wait a minute. It kicked me out of the race. Oh, did it actually? I think it kicked me out too. Oh. Oh, well, that's not good. Okay, I think I know a better place for us. I think... I think if we go to, there's another racetrack. Let me show, let me show everyone on the camera here. There's this one right here near the, uh, the soccer field. If you oh, know where that, that is. Yeah, I see that Yeah, one. yeah. Let's go to that one, dude. I think if we, I think if we race there, it'll be a lot more fun. I think this is the real test of like, whose car is essentially better. What do you think, man? Yeah, this will definitely put it to the test. Exactly. I mean, cause the zero to 60 or whatever, the quarter mile is kind of only based on who has the faster car, which is clearly you, by the way. Um, so I guess this is going to be kind of like, <laughs> we can't really mess this up, though. That's the thing. This is basically like fail proof. Oh, dude, I crashed. I literally oh, crashed this car and it's not even going 60 <laughs> miles per hour. <laughs> This is the first episode of potentially many, by the way, guys. So if you guys want to see more, definitely feel free to let us know because we would definitely love to do more. Because I think, I think, be, I think, Carboom, I think we both enjoy this quite a bit. I'm enjoying this. So. Okay, okay, man. I finished. You finished it? Yeah. All right, man. All right, all right, all right. I'm still like, I'm still a little while away, actually, but <laughs> oh, I'm coming. There you are. There you are. And I'm passing the finish line, and there you go. Your boy finishing with a beautiful time of 150 seconds. <laughs> Just wonderful. Now, what we're going to do, guys, is if you want to go see what Carboom got modded on his car, definitely go check out his video. Again, like I said, he will be linked down below. Check him out anyways, but make sure you watch the video and see what he got done because he clearly got the better of the two cars. So, uh, And you can see what I got done as well, Carboom, because... I clearly picked the wrong choices, so <laughs> you can learn from my mistake. But there you have it, guys. This is the very first episode of our challenge series. Now, if you guys want to see more, we, I've said it multiple times, definitely feel free to let us know because this is something that could potentially be something we could even cross on different games. We could do this on like um, Drive Shaft, for example, or any other modded car racing game. Carboom, I had a ton of fun with this, man. Thank you so much for coming by, and uh, I hope you're excited to do more with me, man. I am so excited. Well, dude, thank you so much for having me. I hope you guys did enjoy this video as well. If you do want more, remember to smash that like button. Let us know in the comments below if you do want to see more. And guys, I'll see you all later. Bye, guys. See ya.